While Americans are wondering if their personal information has been compromised in the Equifax breach, there is a new threat you need to watch. It is your cell phone number. That number is now becoming the key to your identity. Think of it as a new social security number, and anyone can use it to find tons of your personal information. Andrea Day has that story. The most shocking thing was how quickly I found it. Just a few minutes. That's how long it took this guy to track down intimate details about our producer. And that was all with just a cell number. Just a cell number. We blurred out most of the images, but he found reams of information. I found her date of birth. I found where she went to school. For family history, what properties they own, what parking tickets she has. This is the street view of, of her house right now. And all of it without even knowing her name. A security risk? It's a huge security risk. Nobody wants to change the cell number today, and so cell number has become an integral part of your identity. And that's where the problem starts. Full disclosure, Archie Argawal is a cybersecurity expert, but he says tracking down the info doesn't take much. No experience at all. Where do you start with somebody's cell number? So the best place to start is Facebook. We won't show you details, but... Most people don't realize that Facebook, by default, makes your phone number accessible to everybody through their search. He says Facebook does allow you to limit it to just friends, but there is no way to stop friends from finding you by your phone number. If you try to remove your number, Facebook limits some features. Facebook tells us your phone number has, quote, a setting to control who's able to search for you using that info, and that adding a mobile phone number to your account helps keep your account secure and makes it easier to connect with friends and family on Facebook. This information is very incriminating, right? I mean, if you look at it from a job perspective, you have to give your cell number when you apply for a job. Within five minutes, I know everything about you without even seeing whether you qualified for the job, I can just reject you. And he says that's just the beginning. I have your online identity. I have pretty much everything. I own you, basically. And his advice? Treat your cell number as something even more important than your social. Only give it out when you absolutely need to. And for the record, he uses a number from Google and changes it at least once a year. He wouldn't even give us his real number. For Nightly Business Report, I'm Andrea Day.